Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Breaking tragic news about Fox News: Jesse Waters fans left in complete disbelief. Fox News host Jesse Waters is the network's most popular personality, slinging political commentary in a way that's not just brutally honest, eloquent, and intelligent, but exceptionally entertaining as well. He's the station's golden boy for obvious reasons of being young, attractive, and electric and a favorite of President Donald Trump's. Now fans are shocked by what they're learning today after tragic news about the host has been revealed, that's also leaving many feeling furious over what has happened. Waters was just at White House dinner on Thursday having been personally invited by President the President. Trump is reportedly a huge fan of his and former White House adviser Sebastian Gorka, and wanted the two of them there because he couldn't get enough of them on TV. This is a sentiment that many conservative Americans can agree with, as viewership for when Waters is on tends to soar for Fox News. However, we're now learning who Waters' number one fan is who has just played an enormous part in destroying his life. The popular 39-year-old host had just tweeted a picture of his White House dinner menu that had been personally signed by Trump with a message to that read to Jesse, you are great. It was a thoughtful gesture that Waters was rightfully proud of, as anyone would be, which is why he posted it on Twitter. Shortly after, the truth about what he was really up to came out. Now, his life will never be the same in a number of devastating ways by his own decision. The network's prominent host Jesse Waters, who dined on Monday with President Trump, is in the midst of divorce due to an affair with a 25-year-old associate producer. Waters' wife, Noelle Waters, filed for divorce in October. The couple has twin girls. Sources said the 39-year-old host informed the network of his adulterous relationship with Emma Giovine shortly after Noelle filed divorce papers. De Giovine was transferred to the Ingram Angle. De Giovine and Waters are still dating, sources said. A woman at De Giovine's home in Cranford, New Jersey, declined to comment. Within 24 hours of Jesse Waters voluntarily reporting to the Chief of Human Resources in November 2017 that he was in a consensual relationship with a woman on his staff, management met with both parties and a decision was made for the woman to be transferred to work on another program on the network where she currently remains, the spokesperson said. It's truly tragic when a marriage doesn't work out for a reason like this, especially when there are children in the middle of it. It also doesn't seem like Waters was trying to hide his affair which could suggest that perhaps there were some irreconcilable marital issues between he and his wife. That's certainly no excuse for infidelity, but the left is already using the situation to attack the conservative host, ignoring the prolific infidelity within their own party. Sources said rumors of the host's relationship with De Giovine spread within the network late last year as both posted social media photos of their outings together, including on a Caribbean vacation, NY Daily News explained. Both Waters and Giovine are reportedly still in a relationship together even after the announcement of his divorce. It will be interesting to see if or how long they remain a couple after, or if the stress of the public scenario will break them. In the meantime, the mainstream media who never said a negative word about MSNBC's co-hosts Joe Scarborough and Mika Brzezinski having a long affair that ended Joe's marriage as the two remain together today, wants to rake Waters and Fox News networks as a whole over the coals for this. Infidelity is not acceptable nor is treating one affair like a sweet love story and another like a sleazy scandal, all based on political affiliations. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.